Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your own custom particle trails. Let's get right into it. Hello and welcome back to yet again another bucket plugin tutorial. I know, right? Super, super original. Anyways, let's stop wasting time. Let's get into it. So then we're going to be working with the event API once again. And we're going to be listening for the player move event. We want to check to see if the player is actually walking or if they're just moving their mouse around because the event fires for both of those cases. So we're going to make an if statement here. And we're going to check if event.getFrom.getBlock is equal to event.getTo.getBlock. And we're going to take the opposite of this value. So if it is false, then that means the player has moved at least one block. So the first thing we're going to do in here is create a variable for the player. And we can get this from the event. And then we're going to make a variable for the player's world because that's how we're going to spawn the particles. And then we can use this variable to spawn particles just like that. And if you type in particle dot, you can see all the different particles. In the intro, I used heart. But this time I'm thinking I'm going to go for something different. Like firework spark, why not? And then this first value here is going to be the location that you want to spawn on. So we're going to get their location that they were just at. And then the second one is how many of the particle you want to spawn. In the intro, I did one. I think here I will do three just to show something a little different. And then the next three values are going to be the offset. So I want it to offset zero in the x direction. I'm going to put 0 0.5 in the y direction because that's what I did for the intro. And zero for the z direction. And that's all the code done. It was pretty simple. Let's go ahead and see what this looks like in game. Alright, and as you can see, I am leaving up behind a trail of ash because I had to change the particle to that because the one I picked wasn't very good for a trail because the particle shot out in a bunch of different directions. But if I hop on this launch pad, you can see all the particles following me. Just like that. If this helped you out, let me know down in the comments or maybe even leave a like. And if you have any suggestions, let me know down in the comments as well. And that's all for now, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye. Nice! The mutt's nuts, in fact.